Well, I think when you're painting, I don't. You can go to the shop and you can buy so many shades of so many different colours. But I'm a big believer in kind of sticking to the basic, kind of get a basic palette together. You know, um, obviously a good red, a good yellow, a couple of yellows, good white, a, a kind of marine blue, uh, blue, some dark, a couple of dark blues, and you, you, you know, or not even that really, because you just you make you can mix those. But if you just get the basic kind of primaries and a couple of others, there's no there's no point in going out and getting all these sort of fancy subtle shades of stuff because you can you can mix them and you learn when you mix them anyway. Uh, you're learning on the job, so basic palette I would I would recommend from the beginning. But you kinda just jump you can't just jump into a style, a style or something which you which seeps into you over time and as I said before, it's like a visual language, you know, something which you learn, and you can't just, if you, if you, you know, if I can draw a head in this language, it doesn't mean I can, I can paint the rest of the world that this head lives in. I have to, you know, it takes time in sketchbooks and no notepads and and, uh, and thinking and just uh, how to, to to place this in a different, you know, in another world.